All right, so it looks like they had a huge reset at this Walmart. Like, there's so much stuff here. It's awesome. Uh, let's see if they have anything new. Ready to race car builder? Wow, it comes with these tools. This would be great for a kid who wants to learn stuff um, that mechanics learn and stuff like that. Man, so many Hot Wheels, monster trucks. This Ghostbuster vehicle, which is pretty cool. Now let's check out the good stuff. Ooh, a new Transformers. Grimlock. Ooh, that looks really good. See, I love cars that are yellow. Well, certain cars. And my dream car when I was young was a Acura Integra Type R. A yellow one. These are $30, I believe. There's Optimus Prime. Another Grimlock. Man, I really like how Grimlock looks in this version. Seismic Stomp, Cyberverse. Looks very nice. Yeah, we saw that last time. Ninja Turtles. Ooh, they have the Juggy two pack. I didn't see here this la I didn't see these last time I was here. Looks like they still have a whole bunch of Captain America, Thor's, and Iron Man from the 80 years line. Hella two packs. Got Wolverine here. The X Force Wave. Looks like someone might have taken the rest. Actually, I see Guardian over there, so Guardian's there. Let's look at this stuff first. It's Joker and Batman with this set. Adventure Force. It's the budget Jurassic Park line, I guess. Ooh, Scooby-Doo Mystery Machine. This looks like it's really nice for six scale figures. Or sorry, 12 scale figures, six inch figures. Like Marvel Legends, so that's nice. Looks like all these pieces come out, so that's very nice. It's like a tape, it's taped, so I'm not gonna mess with it. I remember having these as a kid, except it came with, I guess this, yeah, it's very similar. That's really cool. How much are they going for? 1884. Same price of a legend. So it looks like they do have Guardian. It's Gambit, it's Blink. Forge back there, tell us. Yeah, someone took Boom Boom and like Sinister and Nightcrawler. We already have that wave, so we don't need it. Another wrestling ring. Except it comes with these collapsing towers, exploding walls. 40 bucks. And some wrestlers, not sure if any of those are new. You know this Tracer figure, Lucio, and a couple other, two other figures, I forget which ones, but they are, there's a, a sale going on, Big Bad Toy Store for like $64, which is a pretty good deal. But I'm hoping these get cheaper at these Walmarts and Targets, because they're just shelf warming. Some Fortnite stuff. Man, it looks like they restocked on these Jazzware figures. I remember like a month or two ago, everybody was looking for this wild card figure. <laughs> I don't see any pictures of them on this. Well, I don't, actually haven't been on the gram as much. I, I don't get on the gram as much as I used to. I need to start posting again. Jeez, it's been been very inconsistent with that. Vesuvius 2488 for this big fella. Ooh, that's actually pretty cool. I would have loved that as a kid. And this reminds me of the character Axel from the video game Twisted Metal. Did any of y'all play that? Well, in this uh, game called Twisted Metal, it was a whole bunch of cars. Um, 
destructive cars with like machine guns and different abilities and stuff but this particular one axel i'll probably put a picture here he was just a human being who actually sat like in the middle of this setup here and then his hands w were spread it out and his legs too and they were connected to this vehicle somehow and he controlled it i guess with his mind or something i don't know it's a very old game see I don't see anything else new so all this stuff but not interested in that yeah let's get out of here check out this Lego set I don't I think it's new but it's the Harry Potter Hogwarts Express because with 801 pieces and I don't see the price yeah there's no price sticker here it's probably pretty expensive but that looks like a nice set I haven't built Legos in so long. I probably should. It's probably really fun and therapeutic. Alright. Let's skedaddle. Okay. Let's see if they have anything new. <laughs> Still have a whole bunch of these uh, Target exclusives. Uh, these 10 inch pops. Ooh, Doug Funny. Definitely one of my favorite shows at one point in my life. Mm. Oh, we've seen all these in the next section. Still need to get some of these predators, but uh, Marvel Legends are swallowing my wallet up. There's Toothless, 90s time capsule. I'd probably love this set to not open until 2019. No, loaded up with 10 big surprises straight from the 90s. I'll probably watch a YouTube video of this, see what they have in there before I partake in that. Alright, 50% off clearance. Ooh, I doubt this is on sale. I wouldn't even get it. It looks cool, but it takes way too much space. Same with this two pack. I doubt it's on sale. I don't know why it's here. This thing should be on sale, I believe. Uh, there's no sticker. A lot of Roblox stuff. Goldberg is going for $15.98. Not bad. I would actually buy him uh, once it goes cheaper. Maybe $7. <laughs> I don't really collect wrestling stuff, but... With certain characters, I might... Mm, they don't really have anything else that I'm interested in. Let's show you guys a quick skim through so you guys can possibly check your targets to see if you guys want any of these items. Alright, let's go to the next section. Alright, we're back at Ollie's Outlet. Let's see if they have anything new. So you got, you know, I don't think I ever showed you guys the out, the layout. You know, there's a lot of people out there that doesn't have a, an ollie near you. So this is like the book section here. So they sell all kinds of stuff, household products. Um, they have some trade paperbacks somewhere back there, um, but. I actually um, been hearing that uh, the Star Wars Black Series are showing up at Ollie's again and I would love to have a couple Royal Guards 
I don't need like Captain Phasma or some other ones, but uh, I would love to have some Royal Guards. I don't have any at all. So we're here at the toy section. Looks like they have this wrestling two pack. Ooh, they have these three and three quarter figures. Yeah, actually, they've, they've had this for a while. 10 bucks each. Still a pretty high price in my opinion. Some more wrestling figures. Let's see, so Seth Rollins, he's going for $5.99. So keep that in mind. Ooh, what is this back here? Oh, it's another two pack, three and three quarter figure. That's going for $9.99. Still pretty expensive in my opinion. Well, got some basic figures showing up here. There's Black Panther, six bucks. I don't see any Black Series. Oh, some Multiverse. There's Batman. Well, I saw this last time as well. Well, last time I found the Black Series here, it was somewhere around this area. I see some Star Wars, but they're all what, Hot Wheels. And this section is a lot of girly stuff. I'll look around. If I find it, I'll show you guys. All right. Well, at least we got lucky with something. So we found some Black Series. And I definitely need a Royal Guard. I'm hoping to at least have one more. Yes, I don't have any of these, so that is really awesome. I don't need 3CPO, or C3PO, sorry. And I don't need him, don't need Death Trooper. I do need a Scare of Storm Trooper, for sure. Oh man, they are stacked. Looks like they have Captain Phasma, they have cloned Captain Rex, some Storm Troopers, some more Royal Guards, so that's good to see. Definitely need one more. I think that's all I need, really. Yeah, there's Lando. Leia. Captain Poe. And I already checked uh, last time, they didn't have anything else. If I do see something else that's interesting, then I will show you all. From Ben 10. All bench figures. Got the World of Warcraft figures. They're going for $4.99. Oh, these Black Series, by the way, are going for $5.99. That's pretty cool. Oh, they have these multiverse figures. It's Metal Batman. He's going for $15.99. They have the Man of Steel as well, as you can see. And that does it. Yeah, some other stuff, but yeah, yeah. Let's get out of here. Let's see. Did this Walmart have a reset yet? I know they're about to have one, but man, they've been taking a while. Let's go. Oh, the retro wave. Tell me they have storm. No, they don't. Of course not. Someone has gotten here before me. It's really good to see these though. And I actually do want. I actually have the whole wave at home. Um, I haven't showed you guys yet. I ordered it from uh, Entertainment Earth. Oh man, someone came here and took both the storms. I think there were two. I think there were two. Uh, actually, I'm not for sure, but so I don't think he Silver Samurai comes two per case. Hmm. Maybe they hit it. Maybe I'll look around. Can we luckily find it somewhere? Nope, I don't see it there. Wow, oh, I should have came here last night. Oh, somebody took a figure from the looks of it. Bastards. War Machine Forge Gambit. 
two of the X-Force Wolverines. Ooh, they have this new the Killer Croc wave. Let's see, you have Robin at the Red Hood and Katana. We have KG Beast, Bane wannabe. And then we have Batman. Do we got the whole wave here? We do. Right? Yeah. I could build Killer Croc. Man, I really like this build a figure. But $20 each. Yeah, I can't get the whole whole wave right now, but I think I will get Robin at least. I don't like most of these figures. I just want the builder figure. <sighs> Maybe I should just wait and just buy the builder figure. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Yeah, I do not want to pay $100 to get this builder figure. I may just pick up Robin for now and then we'll see about the rest. Anything new here? Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, so they do have some new stuff out. I'm going to put all these back in here in a sec. Just taking a second look to see if there's anything else new. It doesn't look like it. If I see anything else new, then I will show y'all. Alright, check it out, guys. I was at the Marvel Legends section. They didn't have anything new. They had all the usual stuff, but they did have this at the end cap. And they only had one. And the employee told me that these are only uh, coming one per store right now. And this is the Infinity Gauntlet, not the Nano Gauntlet, so I don't know why this is coming out right now, but it's going for 88 bucks. And I think it came out, first it came out as $99, right? So I definitely wanted this, and I couldn't find a clearance um, on this item anywhere, so I think it's a good time to pick it up. Alright, that's awesome. Now I gotta, get, now I gotta get the Nano Gauntlet, but that's, uh, gotta save up for that. Alright, let's get out of here. Right, let's see what they have. They have some Overwatch, of course, not on sale yet. Oh, this comes with a, it's a Viola? Viola, Viola, I forget. That's actually pretty cool. I would buy that just for the accessory piece there. It comes with a suitcase. Money in the bank. Only 10 bucks too. Razor Ramon. I used to watch him back in the day. When I used to watch wrestling. As for the Marvel stuff, they do have the Wendigo wave, but of course Nightcrawler and Mr. Sinister is not here. They don't have any two packs or retro wave figures. There's Ebony Maw, the Forge, a couple Captain Marvel. Ooh, Nightcrawler. That's really good to see. Yeah. Nothing else. Like they don't have any Star Wars figures unless it's in this aisle. Ooh, they have the binary form Captain Marvel here. It's my first time seeing it, and it looks yeah, it looks okay. I really like that head sculpt right there with the mask. Other than that, yeah, oh my god, they have like more than 16 in there, it's jam packed. Uh, well, yeah, looks like they don't have any Star Wars. If I see anything else, uh, I'll show you guys. Alright, I'm at a Walmart. Got some cheap juice, because that's how I roll. I got this poster board. I got a, a project that I'm working on. And looks like we have the Funko Pops here. 
side they have the Walmart exclusive Phoenix Reaper as well, which looks really cool, but yeah. I'm okay with that. Here's the Pennywise Walmart exclusive. Comes with holding the knife on his left hand. Looks pretty good. You know what I really want? I want the fourth scale NECA Pennywise. That thing looks awesome. But then again, Hot Toys is coming out with a Pennywise as well, and it's going to have more articulation, so I might want to get that instead. All right, let's go to a different section. All right, let's see what they have. Okay, oh, so they have the binary Captain Marvel. What's that, Doppelganger? There's Cannonball. Oh, okay. They have Stealth Suit Spider-Man. I actually need him. I need him and let's see. Now I need Spider-Woman to finish the Molten Man Wave. Could have got this at Walgreens a while back. It would have been $19.99. So yeah, I could save like a dollar. It's pretty cool. There's Spider-Woman right now. I could actually buy her. Oh, it looks like it's going to be $19.87. Unless this is the right pay. Oh well, either way. Um, I know where a Spider Woman is located. It's at a particular Walgreens and I have a $5 discount. And it looks like they have a gauntlet here. Looks like it's been opened. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Some kid probably ripped it open. Hydra Man, it's good to see. It's boom boom. May pick them up. I'll think about it. They have the Colossus 2 pack. Looks like someone swapped him out. What a dick move. <laughs> yep, that's the old Marvel Legends Colossus. Looks like this one has been opened too. Captain America. Oh, tell me they have. S <sighs> of course, they don't have Storm. I missed it again. I think last time I saw just one wave here. Now they have. Looks like they had two. And someone took her. I keep missing her. Yeah, they have. Looks like everyone except her. As expected. Some hella two packs back there. Wouldn't, wouldn't it be wonderful if the storm was... Ooh, what's down here? Looks like they have an Iron Man. So this is the last Iron Man. Somebody was trying to hide him. And there's a Marvel Legend down there. Scorpion. Someone's trying to hide Scorpion. No storm. No sign of storm. Yep. Yeah, I'll put it back there just so that person come back and maybe find what they were looking for, what they were trying to hide. Why not? Lewis two pack. I think that does it. A whole bunch of Overwatch figs. Can't wait for these to go on sale. I have the Scooby Doo. Look, they have Lord's Ed. That is really good to see. Gotta drop that. Uh. Yeah, I think that does it. Oh, they got some more turtle stuff. Oh, they got this four pack, which is pretty cool. All right, yeah, let's get out of here. All right, we're at the NECA section, and looks like. A lot of the same mold except this Godzilla. This is the which version is this? I think it's like the poster version or something like that. As you see, the painting is a lot different. Looks really good. I really like the packaging too. It's like they have four of them, so I will wait. Oh, I think this is new. Toonie Terrors. There's Jason. 
Ripley, it's really good to see. Come with the basketball. 39.9, that's for Golden Girls. I think these are probably like 26.99. And they have this. I've never seen this, I don't think. No, I have not seen this in person. It looks really nasty. Really cool to be a nice display piece. to wait yeah I think that's about it Nothing. we've seen everything else Just a bunch of cards the office pop it's pretty cool I think these are on sale $23.99 yeah that's about it yeah let's go on to the next spot all right please let spider woman be here please let it still be here Ooh, somebody has been ravaging through and i do see spider woman nice awesome so this is the last one i needed to finish the molten man build a figure and i do have let's see To have five dollars off coupon. Anything else here? Oh, I can't wait for the pink Pyre Ranger to show up at the Walgreens around here. Darth Vader, Cell, Blizzard, Doctor Strange. Another doppelganger back there. And that does it. I think, yep, there's Wasp, Ant Man, Invisible Iron Man. Alright, sweet. Let's get out of here. What's going on, my Rangers? Welcome to the Man Cave. Hope y'all enjoyed the hunt. Um, I had a blast once again, as always, and we found some good stuff, especially at Ollie's. Man, Ollie's is the place to go. If you have one near you, go check it out. You might score some of these too. But uh, yeah, we scored some uh, Stormtroopers last time, maybe like several months ago at Ollie's for the same price for what? Uh, $5.99. So definitely some great deals. And last time when I uh, got these Stormtroopers, um, I didn't see the scare of Stormtroopers and any Royal Guards. So I was very pleased to, to uh, find these for sure because I needed some. I don't have any. So four is perfect. Um, and then the scare storm, the scare stormtroopers, they look awesome. A lot of nice details. Now the royal guards are pretty simple, but it comes with some soft goods, which is very nice. Absolutely wonderful. Looks like they have like a little like a little like a little mini gun or something. I don't remember that in the movie, but uh. And here's a couple of stormtroopers that I acquired as well. So now I, I think I got a total of about six now. So yeah, I'm only building slowly but surely. And then let's see. We got these two from Walgreens. And this was actually the last one I needed to finish the Molten Man Build-A-Figure. And then, yeah, before we got these, we got Stealth Suit Spider-Man from the Walmart, as you guys saw. Looks pretty cool. She looks pretty cool too. And I needed this Doctor Strange for the Illuminati team. For sure. And then let's see. I did uh, pick up something from Ami Ami. And it was this Todoroki statue from the Koto Bukia line. I think it's really pronounced um, Kotobukaya, but I don't know. I've been saying Kotobukaya for the longest time, so it just feels more satisfying to say. But yeah, I should probably say it correctly so you guys can all know how to pronounce it correctly if you don't know. He looks awesome, man. I am really loving these statues. Um, if you guys been uh, watching my videos, then you guys know I have Deku. 
And if you don't know who this character is, uh, he's from the show My Hero Academia. It's an anime. If you if you haven't watched it, man, you need to check it out. Trust me. There's a reason why there's so many My Hero Academia merchandise is coming out, and it's, it's been just they've been just blasting merchandise from this anime like crazy. But man, he looks awesome. This fire uh, effect piece actually comes off. He looks spot on. Really awesome character. I know this is uh, Ricky. If you're watching, I know this is your favorite favorite character. He is an awesome, awesome dude, and he's got one of the best powers. He controls fire and ice. <laughs> That's pretty sweet. It's OP, <laughs> overpowered like crazy. But yeah, that is the haul. I hope y'all enjoyed the hunt. Uh, I'm not going to do any showcasing um, in this video because um, I've been making some really long videos. So I'm not sure which one which one y'all prefer. Do you guys prefer the videos when I do showcases or do you prefer these quick overviews? Um, if anyone wants to comment down below and let me know what you think, you can. But yeah, hope y'all enjoyed. Hope y'all are grabbing some good stuff out there. Um, Man, there's just too many good figures out there, especially from Hasbro, and it's just, it's been nuts. Oh, and by the way, this is, this is a very, well, not very late, but this is a late upload. So I do have another hunt uh, video that I just need to edit, and um, should be up in the next week or so, or sometime before a week or two, so... Just keep that in mind, and if you want to click the notification button so you can get notified when I upload a video, you can do that if you like. And of course, if you like the video, please like it. And of course, if you're new and you want to subscribe, you can do that too. I'd appreciate it. You can join the Rangers. And I'll catch y'all next time, alright? Ranger out! Peace! Peace!